Hello, my name is Ken Dingman, Guarantee RV Center, Junction City, Oregon. Welcome today. Today I'm going to present a uh, trade-in just came in, hasn't been cleaned up so you see how the people kept it. It's a 2008 uh, Beaver Contessa. It's a Rome 4, 40 footer four slide outs. Um, it's a RR10 raised rail uh, Roadmaster chassis, Monaco chassis with 10 airbags, 10 shocks. So it handles wonderfully. The airbags are all on the outside uh, to give you road stability and take the weight of the side of the coach. It's a side radiator, 425 horsepower, Caterpillar C9 engine, 1,100 foot-pounds of torque, MH3000 transmission. Uh, in 2008, uh, Monaco had, had bought Beaver in 2001 or two, uh, and so they were using the Monaco chassis, uh, exclusive Roadmaster chassis underneath the coaches uh, and still had the beaver taste to it. You can see by the woodwork with the you know, beautiful maple uh, wood, all the nice touches engraved. Uh, this is all solid wood. This coach has from air leveling to aqua hot to side cameras and rear camera as a newer TVs, multiplex lighting, it just has a, really a lot of options um, or upgrades on it compared to a lot of coaches. So, um, this one particularly has a big window on this side and the computer desk. This side it has the hide a bed, a little ledge behind it, a pull out kitchen extender. So we have great counter space in here, how deep this is, tile backsplash, three burner, three burner high output stove top, convection microwave that's nice and low so you can actually see everything going on, storage, these are adjustable shelves, both sides, pull out one faucet, ceramic sink, a big one here and then a small one for draining, a little pantry area, storage all around, ice maker built into the fridge, this is a Dometic, so it's a propane or electric fridge, so if you're dry camping at all it's not going to pull all the juice, so work off the propane, uh, dining table, Nice wall mount, nice serving area here. This pulls out. There'll be two more chairs to go with it, so you can sit four. And cool. Nice pantry area here. Pull out. So Beaver had its unique floor plans. This wood pull out. So you know, their fourth lens were a lot of more exclusive to the uh, Beaver lineup when Monaco's building them. So a corner shower with a sit down. Of course, Ray Skylight, fantastic fan. Great vanity. Medicine closets deeper than a lot of them. And the multiplex wiring. So the multiplex wiring got rid of, oh, they estimated about 200 pounds of wire compared to what a normal coach would have uh, because one wire will do up to six functions. So it's a lot more efficient that way. So again, look at this door, how thick it is. Beautiful woodwork. Um, lots of room in the toilet area, has its own sink, another medicine closet, more storage, a window that opens and a fantastic fan, very important things in here. Towel holders, Magnum 2000 watt inverter, uh, three roof air conditioners, ceiling fan, King size bed, nice deep closet, and the other two chairs are placed back there. Oh. You see uh, underneath storage, see how nicely finished this is, real wood, real wood here, nice big shocks. Uh, they kept it up, very, very meticulous people, they just got to a stage in life where they needed a smaller coach, so they traded it and got a uh, a little one. So, um, has he? When it's day with Sony Bra Sony Bravio uh, TVs, 
these are all recessed hinges, nice shocks, a place you can actually sit, sit down and put your shoes on, very important to me, metal guides, all the drawer faces are all screwed and glued, instead of being just stapled, there's the, some of the remote controls, big storage down here, you could use that for a laundry basket, or storage up there. So lot, lots and lots and lots of storage. There's a washer dryer in that cabinet to the left. Yeah. So the washer dryer is easily accessible in the bath area. Separate washer and dryer. There's also another pocket door that closes off the bedroom. So the other upgrade they had uh, done, it was about right at the beginning, was tile all the way through the front. So we don't have the carpet up in here. Padded ceiling. As far as drivability goes, this is a real heavy coach. Uh, power seats, both passenger driver. Uh, power foot rests on the passenger side. Uh, but it's a real heavy, big coach. Uh, good again, good power with the 425 Cat uh, MH 3000 transmission. I don't remember if I said 44,000 miles is what she's got on her. Uh, 10,000 watt generator. I have a build sheet on the coach, and they left all the service records also, so they're very uh, accommodating people as far as that goes. Very proud of the motorhome. So again, Sony surround sound built in, DVD player. They took their satellite receiver with them. They had uh, a direct TV, so it still has a dish on top. Storage and storage. Go outside and see what we got. Again, all the newest features that we have in today's coaches were a lot of them were invented by the Monaco engineers. Like the uh, as the side cameras, it has 3M mask in the front, chrome mirrors, uh, beautiful paint job, uh, nice clear coat on it. Uh, the tires were replaced, I believe, it was in. 2012, they're 295 tires, so upgraded size. It's one of the first that came out with the outside TV, so that it flips up and we have a flat screen in there. Side opening bay doors, pretty easy to get to without whacking your head. Uh, two slide out trays, so that one goes all the way through to the other side, and this one goes All the way through also, so you have, they'll go either way. So you can access the stuff in the middle easily. Probably a propane tank. So the propane's for stovetop and backing up your fridge. The heat and hot water are gonna be with the aqua hot so that you, off the diesel. It's hydronic heat, it's called in hot water. So you get continuous hot water and whisper quiet heat. And they both run off of the diesel tank or electricity if you're plugged in. Yeah. Four, deep cycle, four deep cycle batteries for the house on a pull out tray so you can get to them. They're in series and parallel so it gives you 440 amp hours to stay in power. Big heavy duty battery disconnects. Does have the uh, power awning, awning toppers. And there's a little bath, but uh, we're just coming in trades pretty nice. They just drive, drove from uh, Idaho, so they kept uh, kept it real nice. But the C9 Cat was real bulletproof. Side radiator gives you better cooling, easy access to the rear engine. Power supply comes out of a power cord that's back in here. Tandem actually, you can raise that up if you want to for real sharp corners so you don't scuff your tires. For vent three, so there's a winterizing system, tank monitor outside as well as inside, outside shower. Um, 
Easy to get to your hoses, fresh water connect, all right there. Santa flush, of course. These will be the other side of your pass throughs. Oh, nice. There's a nice big awning on this side for shade. So you coming down there. So, just the very nice, very clean motorhome, uh, real high end stuff. So, if you're interested in this coach, I could send you the uh, factory specs on it. Uh, what other information you want on this coach or anything else on the lot, please give me a call. Ken Dingman, my cell phone's 831 206 8140. Thanks for coming.